32 years in the business, and I've never seen this. A dealer-to-dealer -dealer lot sale. This is suicide. Oh, come on, Don. Stay focused. Let me ask you something, man. You ever think about just dropping everything and going for it? Now, I'm not talking about setting up some studio in the back of a car lot. I'm talking about you, Ricky, and Jason living the life, man, and, and putting yourselves on the line on a daily basis. Wait, what are you, what, what are you doing? Picture this, Paxton. Big Ups touring the Florida Panhandle, right? Gainesville sold out. Pensacola sold out, right? And now it's Panama Beach. Lights go down, and all you can hear is 7,500 girls screaming at the top of their lungs, right? And the bass starts pumping. Pump, 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 pump. And the girls start jumping. Jump, jump, jump. Ricky and Jason, they hit the stage. Dance, 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 dance. What happens next, Paxson? I don't know. What? An engine roars to life. What? I mean, just fucking roars. And who rises from beneath the stage? Who? Jesus. The guy with the best hair in the business. Paxson Hardy. Yeah. <laughs> in the goddamn bandit car. What? Top golden eagle on the hood. And the word is, it's one of only five used in the movie. And the girls, they love it. And you want to know why? Yeah, because we're good. You're goddamn right you're good. You, my friend, are a full-blown rock star in that car. Holy shit. He might have them. I feel like I'm watching a wonder of nature, like a blue whale giving birth or a pig going down on a hyena. You know, Paxton, a man much wiser than myself once said that most men lead lives of quiet desperation. Now, do not silence big ups before the girls. Nay, the world has heard the first verse. Bump, bump, bump. How much for the Trans Am? 200 grand, I'll give it to you for 80. No payments till January. I'll take it! Take this! <laughs> Just got 80 grand for that prop, huh? Big <laughs> This is the new band car! Get it down! Hey, Brent, we would have had a... Wonderful weekend up with that cabin, huh?